Hello YouTube, today I have a Behringer XR X18 digital mixer that has apparently Midas preamps but this one has some problems with the aux outputs So here it is, as uh, you can see, it's not in, a, in best shape, but it's in good shape. It has 16 XLR inputs, two change jacks for in and two change jacks for out, two main XLR one phone out and on the other side uh, it has six six comma three jacks aux sense for monitoring and so on so number one is not working and as i can see something damaged this output as it has the paint damaged too and it hangs a few millimeters out so let's disassemble it to see what the problem is Okay, when you open it, you can see some cables there. And then there's the power outlet, the black one is the Wi-Fi antenna, the thin flat cable and the thicker black cable. So let's take the Wi-Fi antenna out. When you take the brown plastic up, the flat cable goes out. The main oh wow, watch out for these things as it can slip out and do some more damage that you wanna not do. Okay, uh, now I just have to slide it sideways to remove it. So, so, just to side and out. There it goes. Okay, now. I'll just try to give you a better look what the problem is I can see it now so let's make it let's zoom it in so here if you can see it there's the problem and there's the solution here so just stick it back in mm. 
maybe I can film it from another angle just for you to see it better so something fell on it and it has disconnected now just stick it in maybe some super glue but I applied it later by the way I tried to see if there is a chip or a group of chips signed by Midas but there is nothing I think Midas just licensed the preamps so, but uh, there's so as you can see there is no Midas sign but um, even the Behringer mix, the Behringer made this mix console, um, there is no Behringer sign either. So maybe is it is just the Midas design because this mix is doing a great work it sounds good decent it's the cheapest console you can get for the money so now the reassembly slide it sideways back in The Wi-Fi antenna is a bit trickier to reconnect, so I had to adjust my light. And by the way, I'm sorry for my hand that's standing in the way, but it was the only way that I could connect the antenna back in. So the flat cable cable goes back in. And the black clip or the brown clip goes back in the ticker flat cable is it it's in place too the flat cable that goes from the power just check it that is all that it all sits good all other cables are smoother to connect and that's it